Hello, my name is Grace Mbote from the Open University of Tanzania and in this lecture we're going to look at SQL data manipulation language commands. Specifically, we're going to look at SQL special operators. This includes between, in, less than or equal than and other wildcard commands in SQL. Remember, we're going to use MySQL database with a sample database and I hope you acquire necessary skills that you'll need, you'll need in using SQL. Now, in this lecture, we are working on SQL, basic uh, select statement, where we're going to, to learn about SQL special operators. First of all, uh, we're going to see the, a table called products which have been created before because uh, the, the process of uh, creating a table have been covered in the previous uh, lecture. So let's, let us see how the table product looks like, the, the relation schema by using describe, describe uh, products. You must be in SQL and you, you selected the database that you'll be working on. Describe products, you put a semicolon and then you press enter. There we have a product table which has uh, four columns called called. Called uh, is an integer whereby it must have a value and it's a primary key. We have an, a product name with a name and a text. Price, it's a number, double. And it must have a value. It must not be null. And manufacturer, uh, it's an integer with a not null uh, constraint. And now let us look what what kind of data is in that table in products table. We do select star, which means select all from. With the select statement, you put a select. And then you put a column name for to, to retrieve data from every column. You put a star, select all from, and then you specify a table name. Whereby in this case it's products table. Say products. Put a semicolon at the end. You press enter. There we have we have a code column with code one to ten. We have name of the products. These must be computer products with hard drive, memory, zip drive, price, and manufacturer. Now let us learn about special operators that we can use in querying our database, in, manipul in manipulating the data in our database. The first one we're going to use is as follows. It's a less than size. Let's select all products where price is less than 200. Tanzania shillings. We're going to use Tanzania shillings as a, as a currency. Now select all, we are selecting all columns from products, our table. Be very careful with spelling where price is less than 200, two shillings, Tanzanian shillings. Put a semicolon, you press enter. There we have. We've got how many products there? We've got uh, seven products, whereby it, their price is less than 200 shillings. And remember, SQL is not case sensitive, but it has reserved words, whereby we're going to learn about that in another lecture. Now, let us use another operator, which is less or equal. You... We use select select all from products where price is equal is less or equal to 150 t shillings. This select statement 
will retrieve data for all products which price is less or equal to 150. We press enter. There we have got five products whereby the first product is 120, the second one is 150, the third one is 5, the fourth one is 90, and the last one is 66. Now, let us learn uh, about another operator called like. We do select. Uh, name and price column from products table where name like D When we put like and uh, with a percentage sign after the letter, that means we are looking for products whose name starts with D. I press enter. There we have two products, DVD drive and uh, DVD banner. These are all products which name starts with D. Let us uh, use the percentage sign with like. This is called a wildcard operator. We select name and price from the same table of products where name like we are looking for products whose name ends with the letter D, if there's any. You put semicolon at the end of your statement and then you press enter. It returns empty set because there are no products which, uh, which name ends with the letter D. Let us use the letter Y to select a product which ends uh, with the letter Y. We do select name Price from products where name like you put quotes a percentage sign y you put another quote you put a semicolon and then you press enter. There we have we have a product called memory with a price of 120. And now let us uh, let us look at another special operator called between we are, we are, we are going to select all products we, with a price between 50 10 shillings and 150 you put a select select all you can either all, select all columns or a specific column it doesn't matter from products table where price between 50 and 150 you put semicolon at the end and then you press enter there we have we've got uh, four products with a price uh, between 50 and 150 now let us look <clears throat> at another operator which is not between you just select let's say name price from products where price not between 50 and 150 you put semicolon at the end you press it there we have we've got six products with uh, with price not uh, between 50 and 150 now let us look at um let us work with another operator 
um, in you do select all from products table where name in that means we are looking for names with which is either a drive or a memory you put semicolon at the end you press enter there we have we have one product uh, with the name memory and we don't have any product with the name drive now let us look at another special operator Uh, we it's an echo sign select code and name and price from products where name equals to memory. You have to put quotes before and after the name. There we have we have one product called memory with the code uh, code number two and the price of one twenty. In using SQL select statement, there's a way you can order by you can order your outputs either by ascending order or descending order. Let's let us look at this example select all from products where oh, select all from products order by order by price descending that means starting with the highest price within those products you do the reverse of the previous command select all from products order by price in descending order or uh, in ascending order there we have this is the end of our lecture on SQL special operators and wildcard commands used in select statement where we've learned about less or equal greater than between not between a percent sign and in. Thank you for watching.